Okay, so Maxim is a, is a producer of um, energetic materials. Okay, and, um, and, and, and we work in, it's a company made up of um, four large components, one being uh, uh, chemicals, and the chemicals really underpins the civil explosives or commercial explosives business, which we call Terra Solutions. Um, and then we have a military business, which uh, supplies into the military um, explosives industry. And um, we have a hunting business called Outdoors, which makes cartridges for hunting. Maxim is 150 years old, um, pretty much 150 years old. Started in 1872 um, in uh, Goldogano in Spain by Alfred Nobel. Um, that's the history of dynamite, if you go and read it up on the internet. And, um, and the company has gone through many evolutions. It now consists of about 6,500 people. Um, it's present in um, probably about 140 business units across the globe. Um, so it's pretty much a global company with um, a very large footprint wherever there's mining and then obviously the other businesses wherever that's required. So um, it's, a very, it's a very dynamic business, um, it's got a very interesting culture. Um, but we supply um, this part of the business, Terra Solutions, supplies explosives to um, in mines on a large scale, also quarries, construction, um, but generally sort of uh, in the earth business. Okay, so um, in this part of Africa, in the southern and eastern part of Africa, Maxim is not too well known, even though the company has actually had a presence here for about 40 years. Um, and this is part of our strategy is to grow really fast in Africa. Um, so we've, the mining in Darbo is a nice uh, launch pad for branding, for brand building of your primary brand, um, you know, the Maxim brand. Then also for our secondary brands, our product brands. Uh, which are pretty unique and, and, and different to offerings from other companies. So in, in order to establish ourselves and get a brand awareness, this is a great place to be. Um, all our customers are here. Um, it's the one place where I can meet the CEO with Adi's um, assistant being present to block you. <laughs> the Indaba has been great. Um, so, so a couple of years ago, the Indaba was quite depressing. The commodity cycle was on a decline. And I think everything's starting to look better. So there's, there's been a, it was a positive in Dalva, a lot of attendance, um, uh, many, many uh, interesting discussions. And, uh, you know, all, even the talks were, were uplifting, let's put it that way. So there's new investment coming, new exploration coming. Obviously, the challenges are always there for the industry. So when our customers grow, we grow. And when they don't grow, we don't grow. So that's, that's a simple, unless we take market share, of course. And, Look, I think um, generally um, um, uh, in, in our, our customers are evolving. They're going to, um, it's, the, it's the electronic era that's, that's coming into the business um, in mining and uh, automation and a few other things. So, so you will see from us some new technologies. Um, uh, we have a product called Rio Cloud, which is part of our integration of our customer interface. And that, that combines with our equipment on the mine. All our equipment gets networked into the systems of the mine. And, um, you know, we're moving towards that. We, we, I mean, obviously levels of automation and recording data and sharing data, analyzing data, um, predictive stuff where, where, where technology provides options for us to predict what the outcomes that we want. And uh, somewhere behind me, I think you can see a, a, a drone. Um, drones are actually quite useful in our industry um, for, for many purposes. One is actually just accuracy and making sure that the, the mine operation is, is where it's supposed to be, the holes are drilled where they're supposed to be. Um, so we have good data now, we can actually predict the outcomes that we want on the, on the, on, during the blasting. And the specific drone behind us actually one that also checks for air quality, a post blast, so we know if the explosives are converted, uh, if the chemistry is actually working properly. So. Absolutely, uh, um, this was, it's, it's a big investment um, and, and if a company takes this very seriously, it's very useful. It takes a little while to build your brand, it's not a one year event, you cannot do that in one year. So, so for us it's a, it's a long term, we see it as a long term investment and uh, we're very proud to be here. And in fact, um, one of the interesting things about being relatively new in, in this event is that uh, people come and ask you what you do and, and which is, which that's the right answer. We want people to come and ask us what we do. And uh, so we've had, we've had a, 
Um, we've now had a couple of years of coming to this event. Um, you know, our stands have grown um, bigger and we brought a better team every time to to, to, um, to expand our sort of presence um, opposite the customers. And I think we'll definitely be here.